Good morning, ladies and gentlemen, um, and welcome to our 100th birthday party. To open the event, I'd like to hand over now to Her Worshipful, the Mayor of Poole, Councillor Zena Dion. Good morning. Another lovely sunny day in Poole, I see. It's um, great to see people out here. This is really quite a momentous event because anybody that's been brought up around this area will remember the old sort of Hanson Dorset buses across the conurbation. And, um, and I was certainly brought up in Ashley Cross and catching the bus for tuppence each way up to the hill to where I used to go to school. Because anybody that knows young children, we don't do hills, so it was easier to catch the bus. But um, seeing the buses here, it's just, it, it really is a sort of trip down memory lane. But it's amazing how buses have evolved from the times that we used to do the sound of the, um, yeah, from the, from the time that, you know, we used to catch the buses, you know, you'd buy your ticket from a bus conductor, if it was a really exciting day, the bus inspector would get on and, you know, we'd show them the ticket. But now you can get on a bus, you don't even need money, you can have your card that you buy and you just swipe it, you can um, do your homework online, you can practice safe text and you don't even and you can get off the other end and you don't even almost have to talk to anybody but it's amazing it is a place of work and a place of communication but without having to talk to people live it's a very very sort of strange but comfortable experience because so many of us are really busy and when we get on the bus it's great to, you know a bit like a train it's great to be able to do the work while you go along it's um but but buses isn't just oh and also how comfortable they are um, I don't know if any of you are catching buses at the moment, but they're certainly a lot more comfortable. And why would anybody, you know, drive? But um, I think one of the things that's really important as well is how much buses contribute to our local economy. Getting people from A to B, getting people to work, getting people to the shops, that all contributes to our economy. So they do much more than just increasing the numbers of people using the buses. They also employ just been speaking or hearing about how many people they employ in the conurbation and it's about 400 which is just you know incredible and, and these jobs are important to our local economy so i really want to sort of thank the more bus company and the previous hanson dawson for the journey to actually still be in this area and still be contributing so much and getting people around so really a warm welcome to everybody Thanks very much to our MD, Andrew Wickham, for the work that they do in this area. And um, so I'll hand back and say thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you very much, Madam Mayor. So welcome to our 100th birthday party, our centenary event. Um, there's lots of rides and buses to be had later on. The programme is available and every penny we collect today will go to Julia's house. Um, both myself and my colleagues in the company are immensely proud to have served Poole and the surrounding areas, Dorset, Hampshire, Wiltshire, for a hundred years now. What we did then is exactly the same as we do now. We provide safe, economical and attractive transport for people across the region making essential journeys. Um, and I'd like to pay tribute to some of our former colleagues, particularly those who many years ago now went off, they had a safe, predictable life on the buses, and in 1939 they went off to fight in the Second World War. Sadly, some of those people didn't return and they made the ultimate sacrifice for their country. We still remember those people with plaques in our shops and in our walls that, that commemorate the sacrifice that they made. We have a lot of old buses here today, just a few here and a few more in Selday, and obviously from up on the quay up the road there, we have rides on, on the old buses that we start on shortly. It's important for us to remember it's not only about the buses though, um, a lot of it is about our colleagues over the years who have sort of got up in the middle of the night to come to work in all sorts of weathers. They did a great job then and they're still doing a great job now for the local community, and that is providing essential transport getting people to work, getting, um, getting people to school, on dates, to the pub, all sorts of things, the hospital, and making a real positive difference to people's lives, and they do a great job with that. Um, I want to thank you to everyone here who has brought buses, brought these wonderful old buses in for us, and thank you also to colleagues who have given up their time, given up their Sunday, to 
come and, and, and make the event today work. So have a great day and enjoy riding our old buses. Thank you.
a bus down there leaking deep. Thank you. 